I don't know. I wonder if it's. I guess it's okay for me to for for me to tell this story. But back in the day, believe it or not, guys, this is a long time ago. A long time ago, I liked someone. <gasps> uh, Ooh. They were a really really good friend of mine, Ooh. and the only person that like kind of didn't treat me like shit where I went to school. And like, uh, I remember they looked over at me and they were like, do you like One Piece? And I was like, I was like slumped over in my hoodie drawing at my desk, drawing fucking anime. <laughs> and, and they were like, do you like One Piece? And I was like, yeah. And they were like, cool, me too. And like, they were extremely like popular though, but they were kind to me. And like, they like we would, right? But like, they would like come pick me up and we'd drive around and like just talk shit and just like have a fun time and drive around the city and like hang out in the garage and stuff like that. And I really liked that person. And I figured out that that person's favorite, I found out what that person's favorite gift was ever, like, or what their favorite music was. They were really in love with, um, with uh, I think it was the Orange um, album by Frank Ocean. And we'd listened to it a lot when we were driving around. And so um, for their birthday, I looked everywhere that I could to try and find it and I bought it. <sighs> Um, for them and I gave it to them I remember on my patio and they like looked me in the eye and said this is the greatest gift anyone has ever given <gasps> at Channel Orange and I felt like oh, I felt so happy and then a couple days a couple days later we went to the same uh, New Year's party and I watched them kiss someone else <laughs> on the countdown Oh my and God. I went and I cried in my car and I uh, oh. and I never fell oh. in love again. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 Go back and smash that album into bits. Yo. No, I, I want them to be happy. I want them oh. to live a happy life. But, but I mean, I don't know. Like, it's just like, you know, oh, this is the greatest present God, I've ever given. That just sounds so misleading. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then... I mean, I don't know. I think that they were also confused about whether they liked me or like whether they could like a, a Shinigami mm -hmm. or like, I think there were a lot of like other like moving parts to it that like I as as an adult Reaper now look back and see that like they just might not have been into, into Shinigamis. Like that's right. it, you right. know? Maybe they were into like demons and stuff like that. And it's right. a bit complicated, but that was basically... um. That was a part of my my old lore from back in the day, um, but uh, now I'm okay. I'm happy because I've found love in different ways uh, with <laughs> all my buddies. And um, I, yeah, I only have feelings for Adam Sandler now. You see, <laughs> Adam Sandler and Shrek, also <laughs> Jolene, they're all a part of my wonderful harem. So it it's fine. It doesn't matter. <laughs>